I I would bet based on the term hot Atlanta that you just spend more time cooling than heating, but I'm not sure. It's a good question. This is from my knowledge from 10 years ago. I know we had more heating degree days than cooling degree days in Atlanta, but like two or three about a decade or so ago. I'm not sure if that's changed or not. Let me show you guys something real quick. So we tend to spend more on heating. Um, oh, interesting. Yeah. And so this is the load calculation for this house. Wait, is this okay. you're about heating houses or like heating food? I, I guarantee we spend more on heating food. <laughs> I, I, we <laughs> definitely do. <laughs> yeah. So this is the, the load calculation. This is the blower door page. Um, let me show you. This is, so the loads on this house, this is for the entire house, Matt. This is for 3,800 square feet. Sensible cooling is 28,000 and it's 18,000 heating, okay? Wow. So this is with the 0 0.01 ACH50 entered in as our blower door result. So 18,000 pretty low load, 28,000 uh, also um, very low for 3,800 square feet, right? So if we go to this page, this is a 0 0.01 ACH50. Let's go to five ACH50, this is the code. This is what we're allowed to, to do here are allowed in Georgia. So now we've doubled our heating oh and we've gosh. only gone up and we've only gone up three or four thousand in cooling. This is why we spend more money on heating than we do cooling because of air leakage. Almost a hundred percent air leakage and uh, heat loss through the slab. So if I took the heat the insulation off the slab in this design, that number would go even higher, but only on the heating side. So this air leakage is a big deal. We want to just, contr again, control it all. But we spend more until we go tighter. Then we actually spend more on cooling. And this, this is pretty an in, an, a pretty interesting thing when you look at the loads for, of a tight versus not tight house. Yeah, that's fascinating. That's, that's really cool to see that. Thanks for showing us that uh, switch on the manual J with that air tightness. That's really cool.